Welcome back. We are the Tabletop Knights. Victor and TJ with you once again in Dice Throne Season 2. We today uh, are the Vampire Lord and a Seraph. Yeah, our final battle for the season, or at least well, the final box set of the season for us to check out, which should be pretty entertaining. What made you choose Seraph? Honestly, I pretty much just flipped a coin in my head and went, mm, that one. Okay. <laughs> all right, so... Uh, I think every character this season I've been pretty happy with. So. Yeah, they're all pretty badass. Once again, if you see any mistakes, let us know. We've had a good read of these characters before we've started, just to make sure that there's not any starting um, uh, things that we're going to miss. Last time, I think you missed to have some synth. I think so, um, yeah. And that could have you could have won the game with that. I might have. That could have so been that a game changer. Been the difference. So we'll definitely go back and do... The the um, Artisafar Artif- versus the... What was the other person? Dude, what makes stuff versus Curse Pirate? Was Curse it? Pirate, yeah. yes. So we'll go back and do them eventually. But for now, let's dig into this one. Who will be going first? Probably... Uh... Probably not you. <laughs> hey oh, it's right. me. Who would, who would you like to go um, first? I'll take firsties. Okay. Everyone draw four cards. Excellent. All right. You're going straight for the roll. Going straight for the roll. Don't need, right. a, need or want to do anything to start with anyway. So starting health, we're doing 40. Uh, oh, you've all got you've got three sixes there. Yeah, You're close I'm, to an I'm ultimate already. That. This is not a good start for me. <laughs> I'll keep them, that's for sure. He's going for an ultimate straight up. Ooh. Oh, that's a shame, but I can do. Spend a CP. Same Z's. Change the value of one of your dice to be identical to the value of one of your other dice. Boop. And I will use Helping Hand for one CP, which is select one of your opponent's dice and force them to re roll it. I'll get you to re roll that one since it's there. Fair enough. Hopefully it's not a six, otherwise... Uh... Oh! <laughs> All right, do I have anything else that I could do? Uh, no, that's it. All right, so you're going for an ultimate straight Boop. off the bat. Ultimate off the bat. Not mostly. a natural ultimate, though, so oh, it's yeah, not as yeah, impressive yeah. as me. It's like four of them were. That's not that bad. <laughs> Split the heavens. Gain flight. Bloop. Which is an interesting one, because a uh, player with this token may spend it at any time during a roll phase. Once uh, once spent, roll two dice. If a six was rolled, activate the token. If activated during an offensive roll phase, attack becomes undefendable. If activated during a defend, ignore all incoming damage. It's not, it's bad. not a bad little token. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Holy Presence. Holy Presence is good. Yeah, deal one damage to all opponents. During their upkeep phase, a player with this token deals one damage to all opponents. This token may not be transferred by any means. But can be removed. But can be removed. It does say that in little parentheses there. I also gain a Blessing of Divinity. Which you can only have one of, but that means that... uh, Stack limit one. If he was to reach zero health, he gets to go to one life instead. Yeah, instead of dying, I get to keep one health and then spend the token. It gives you an extra turn, basically. I suppose, theoretically, you could then get it again if you're super lucky on that turn and just try and live out on one health constantly. And how much damage are you doing? And 13 ultimate damage. It's actually not as much as I thought it would be, to be honest. I think most of the ultimates are 13. Around that sort of... That puts me on 27. Yes. There we go. Wow, what? That's like two turns with an that's, ultimate. That's not a bad start. Now to I have to do nothing but good rolls for the for the remainder of the game. All um, right. Um, are you done? No, no main or discards for me to do on this one. So, yeah, no, all yours. All right, well, I'll gain a CP that I just wasted. <laughs> but if it was the time to use Helping Hand, it's look, it could have used It could have worked in your favor and yeah, stopped that off. Absolutely. All right. Um, hmm. I will use one of those CP to use double up. Draw two cards. All right, and I'll use zero CP to use our favorite card, Vegas Baby. So we gain. roll a dice and gain yeah. half a CP. So two. Four. 
four, two. It's yep. pretty good. I need to get some heals. Your bleedy eyeball roll. I need to get some heals. Do I have anything that can heal? I do have a heal here, but it's only heal two. But I can also steal a health uh, on my defensive yeah. roll as well. And I think I have a token here as well. So if I get if I get four of these tokens and I use them, if I deal damage to you, I gain that much health. Not bad. So Not bad good. at all. Yeah. Okay. Um, all right. Let's go for a roll. Hmm. Eyeballs, hands, blood. Blood is handy. Always. You could shoot for a straight there pretty easily. You've I got do have four, five, six, and then one, two. So you can shoot for the two, three, four, five, six. I will do that, thank you. Just let's have a look. Um, what's that? Going around the camera. Hmm. Still got one more roll. Interesting. <clears throat> Just trying to suss out what is best for me right now. <sighs> All right, I'm going to re-roll those two. But then I'm... Actually, yeah, I can, I'll be able to do something. Fours. Oh, look, one of my fours is an off color. It is too. I yeah. saw that come up before, actually. Glitch. No. Okay, so we've got uh, four eyes, which isn't really anything. I, I mean, it's something here. Well, you've got the three for glamour there. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Um, I've got enough for sanguinity. <laughs> if I can heal two and gain three blood power. or it's probably not a bad I can move. gain one CP, gain mesmerize, deal four undefendable damage. Um or I can do something here to change a dice if I want to. Hmm. Alright, I'm going to go, uh, yes, for this one that I cannot pronounce. Fair enough then. Yeah. <laughs> um, which, yeah, so I gain three blood power. And I heal two. And I do no damage to you. So not the best first roll ever, but... Hey, we got Get something off, um, but three uh, blood, blood power is very valuable, so I will take that. Alrighty. Do, 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 do. That's yours? Yeah, that's my turn. Thank you. Cool. Uh, upkeep, take a damage from my holy presence. Tick. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Pay attention, Vicky. I was, I was reading <laughs> my abilities to make sure I wasn't... Uh, Missing anything? Missing anything, because we've missed we missed a few things last. We do that time. sometimes. That's all right. That's part of the process, and we're all human and learning and all that sort of jazz. We're just normal people like you out there watching us in intertube lands. Can a CP? Draw a card. Do -do -do -do. Hmm. Alrighty. On to the rolls. Ah. One, two, three, five, six. Could definitely do worse, but could definitely do better. Alrighty. I think we'll keep the one, two, three, five. Let's see if we can't pull off four. Nope, that's a one. But that's still good. You can, and you still oh, have it's another, still, yeah, you still have another go. And I've still got one more. A six. Interesting. <clears throat> all right. Well, that gives us... Did you do your upkeep phase, draw, draw a card and everything? Yeah, yeah. And I yeah, did all that uh, just before I move on. I will... Pay a CP. To play Try Try Again. Me or a chosen teammate may re-roll up to two dice. Try, try again. Oh. But you got an extra there for your first ability. I did. For your holy blade. Which will trigger a holy blade. Uh, and I will also activate my flight token. So roll two dice. If a six was rolled, activate the token. 
Du, 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 du. Ooh, oh, no dice. Pause. No dice there. So, uh, it'll just be the six damage. Six damage, not undefendable. Not undefendable, no. just straight up. I was trying to make it undefendable with the flight. But so I get three dice for defensive. Whew. Ooh, they're all eyeballs on One, double two, eyes, gain, a gain a blood power. So yeah, <laughs> up to four blood power it, and yeah. taking six damage. Yeah, exactly. So I take six, so that puts me down to 22. Ouchies. So I'm, I'm doing right for the first time in my matches Dude, ever. Dude, I'm so glad for you. <laughs> <laughs> so it's I've a hit, nice change. <laughs> so I've hit my max stack limit as well. So that's... Uh, ah. I can do something. All right. <laughs> All right. Uh, is that your turn? And that'll be turn for me, yeah. Hey, you're still beating me by 18, so that's a big advantage. I'll take what I can get. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> um, I will uh, sell this card. I'll put it face down so you don't know what it is. Oh no! To gain a CP because I know I'm never going to use it. Yeah, that's fair. Um, all right, let's uh, go for a roll. See what we can do. All right. Just when you think you might have something, you'd have a small straight. All right. Mm. Got the one, two, three, four in there. Do three. Oh, that was a that was a four, but I'm gonna re-roll it anyway. Yep. So one, two, three, four. Five. Five. We have a large straight. Large or small, take your pick. <laughs> <laughs> I'll choose the large, thank you. Fair Actually, enough. Actually, maybe not. Because you're already at max blood power. Would... So unless you burn some blood power before you activate your ability. Um I don't know what your blood power does in particular, but unless you burn now, some off. I'll use the large straight. You'll use the large there. anyway? Um, all right, so uh, it is, uh, but I can also use my four blood tokens anyway. So heal equal to the amount of damage you successfully deal from this roll phase. Ah. So I'll use those. So I'm not sure if I now gain that blood power back. Or... Uh, you wouldn't be able to use them until after the attack had gone off because you don't know what damage you're doing yet, do you? Well, I'm adding it to the attack now. Oh, yep. Yeah, Touche. You know, that, that makes sense. Sorry. It's up to you. No, no. As, that as, works for me. as the losing player in the <laughs> past, not currently, should I get another blood token? I would assume you, you spend the tokens first to then make sure you can get the token. Okay. That's, that's the way it would be advisable to do Let it. us know your opinions on the matter. All right. Um, but it's only one anyway. Exactly. I inflict bleed. Who oh, no. knew? So that's you. Um, and just so you know, uh, on your upkeep phase, you roll one dice. On a one to four, you receive one damage. Otherwise, you remove the token. Yep. So that's not bad. And it's only a stack limit of two. So I oh, can inflict another bad. one to you. Uh, then I deal eight damage. And I don't have Mesmerize, so I can't do anything else. So. Cool. I will roll my single defense dice. Is that all you Ooh. get? Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Yeah. E yeah. Mm. Uh, on wings, prevent one damage. So... So I'm deal dealing seven, but because uh, I used four, I heal equal to the amount of damage you successfully dealt. So I gain seven health. Mm, no bad. Yeah. Uh, so what does that put me on? Uh, Twenty-nine. Thirty-three. And just like that, it's almost level again. <laughs> Interesting where she balances out. Yeah. Well, see, what they do is they make the characters, and then they get to the defensive role, and because you are okay. overpowered, they're like, we'll just give her one. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> we'll be the only character to have one defensive role. All right. That's your turn? Uh, yes. Thank you. Cool. Caught up a little bit there. Gain a CP. I will then play getting paid. Gain two CP. Is that a free one? Yeah. Zero That's CP cost. Valuable. Valuable. So let us know if you guys like the overhead view. It's uh, We're trying something a little different this time. Uh, I'm then going to spend 2 CP to play Transference. Transfer one status effect token from one chosen player to another chosen player. Have your bleed back. <laughs> <laughs> now you will be... Oh, wait, also, I also get one damage dealt to me because of your thing, Holy Presence. Uh, oh, yes, because my upkeep. Yep. Yeah. Tick. 
And then during your upkeep, you'll take again. Ha yeah. ha ha But I can roll. My it. plan is coming <laughs> together. <laughs> you try to make me bleed. Hmm. Interesting. You've got the start of a straight there. One, two, three. Yeah. You going for another ultimate? No, I just wanted a shield because shields are handy. And another shield. Of course, multiple shields are always handy too. Hmm. What do you have? Not much. So you have two shields. Two shields, two feathers. Well, they're actually pendants, sorry. Angelic pendants. Oh, my, my bad. No, I just only just looked. <laughs> I also want the dice thrown religious people to be like, they're pendants. Okay, pendants. <laughs> Funny looking little wing things. I'm going to spend my last two CP, take me down to zero, to play so wild, change the value of any one dice. I will flip this one to a cross. Giving me what I need for a holy smite. I'll put you in the discards. You can go there. Roll four dice. Deal two times holy sword things. Undefendable damage. On a wing, gain flight. On a cross, gain cleanse. On a shield, inflict blinding light. I'm nervous. Cross, cross, cross. Cleanse, cleanse, cleanse. Well, you got all three. There you go. Stack limit of three. So that puts me to my stack limit for cleanse. And you just cleanse. got three. And a shield inflict blinding light. No, oh, thank you. So next time a player afflicted with this token concludes their offensive roll phase. So once you've finished all your dying rolling and all that jazz, roll one dice on their on a one. Your roll phase has no effect. On a two or three, any damage they deal for the remainder of the roll phase is reduced by half. Okay. I assume if you roll above that, nothing happens. Ah. Uh. Cool. And yeah, it doesn't do any damage because I didn't roll any swords to go with it. But that'll be turn for me. All right, my turn. I will gain a CP, which I now have six. Building. Hey, I will use getting paid to Don't gain... Don't forget to your bleed. Oh, yep. To gain another two CP, and I will roll for a bleed of one. That's a bleed. I got bled. Yeah. I got blooded. All right, um, let's get some stuff happening. <laughs> like you go and they lift their cards dramatically. All right. Um, I used to love that show. <laughs> when I was but a youth. Do you reckon I can use this blood power like before I do a roll? So my one token, if your offensive, if your offensive roll phase results in an attack, add two damage. This counts as an attack modifier. So I can use this now. And assuming I roll a, I mean, you could activate it now. I would assume you wouldn't want to activate it until you actually start your offensive roll phase, though. I will activate it, and then I will use two CP one and two to use. What status effects? Remove all status effects from a chosen ah, in player. In which case, you did that the other way around. What do you mean? In which case, you did that the other way around. Because that's a main phase card. And from what I'm understanding, that token you don't want to activate until your roll phase. Ah, uh, yes. Okay. Not that it really matters. No, 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 just no, no, for... But I have to uh, resolve applicable status effects. Choose one card. Main phase. Play ability upgrades. So I could play that ability first and then play this card. Yo, tokens are instant, so you can play them during any phase. So yeah. if, if it is one that modifies your dice, I wouldn't want to play it until you're about to use your dice. Kind but of in this case, because... I don't I'm think gonna... it really matters in this instance. No, because I, this is considered a status effect, so I wouldn't want to okay. remove a status effect. Yeah, no, good instance. point. Yeah. So I thought I'd... Oh, oh, that's yours. I'll take my blinding light I back. didn't want to remove a positive status effect from myself because I'm pretty sure it's all of them. I don't get a choice of... All status effects. Yeah. yeah, it's just purge everything. So that's not a bad card, but I haven't. we haven't really... In the season two, we haven't had many status effects to remove, I've found. Doubloon. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that was it. All right, um, now I'll go for a roll. One, two, three, four. <clears throat> four. Yep. So you get your small straight there. And I got Bupkis all CP for dicking with you, so... So, one, two, three, four. Might as well go for a large again. 
Four again. Got one more. Why not? Four again. Have some eyeballs. So I have. I do have a small straight there. Um, You're possessed. I will do that. I will go for a small straight. So deal seven damage and roll one. On a hand, inflict bleed. On an eyeball or blood, gain mesmerize. But I'm also dealing an extra two damage because of blood power. Yeah, blood power. On a hand, inflict bleed. So I'll take a bleedy. We're just swapping these bleed tokens left Um, and right. Because that I'll take anyway, and I'll just roll my defendy dice. Shield prevent three. So what did you have? Seven. So I'm doing nine. nine, Minus three, six. Six. One, two, three. Four, five, six. Wait. Three, zero, one, two, and three. So what are you on? Uh, 27. I'm on 27 too. Ooh. So we're back to level. Uh, and I believe that'll end my turn. Cool. Alrighty. Uh, upkeep, so take a damage. Yeah, oh, sorry, I'll just take a sip. Though. Yeah, alright. <laughs> No, do it now. Ah. No time for drinks and sustenance. You have to roll your bleed. Um, yes, and I do need to roll my bleed as well. There you go. No bleed for me. <laughs> this bleed token is going around the world. Uh, cool. Boop. Grab the dice. That probably looked really inappropriate on camera. <laughs> <laughs> One 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 four four. Um, one one three four four. So you've got the middle bit of a straight. <laughs> it's a bit like that, man. Keep that aside. One two three four gives me a small straight as well. Mm. Not bad. I Sunny. will. What do I want to go with? That's the question. Actually, I'm going to re-roll that one, one of those ones I had before, so I've now got my straight still, but I'll see if I can enlarge it. No. No enlargements for me. What a shame. So what are you going for, small straight? Uh, actually, I'm going to use glorious. Glorious. So I will gain flight. Yeah. Which I will then immediately spend. Yeah. To then roll two dice. If six was rolled, no, nope, no six is there. That's a hard token, that one. It's Yeah, it's one you want to kind of spam out as much as possible. It's though. like my Mesmerize, again, um, if I get a five or a six. So again, my flat immediately use it, so take six damage. Cool. Well, do your defendy roll. Defendy roll of three dice. All right. So I gain a blood power, and that's it. And otherwise take six damage. Yeah. Down to 21. 20. 20. 20. Oh, yeah, because tick. Goddamn ticks. All right. Is that your turn? And that will be turn for me, yeah. Decent turn. Decent turn. But you did go first, so if I level up this time... Yeah, it's staying pretty even. Yeah, Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. Yeah, it's staying even. All right, so I'll gain a sepe and draw a card. I will use... Blood letting, which is zero CP, to gain one CP and one blood power. Ooh. <clears throat> and uh, I will go for a roll. Bit of a roll. He's on a roll. Man, I'm rolling a lot of those. <laughs> yeah, you, you're really liking your eyeballs. Um, I've got a four, five, six. I'm going to go for an ultimate, I reckon. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. That was... That. (laughs) Alright, so... I'll use samesies. Yep. For one CP. And I'll spend the CP first. Change the value of one of your dice to be identical to another one. Yep. And then I will use twice as wild for three CP. 
One, two, three. Putting me on four. And which uh, changes the value of any two. Any two, yep. Would you no, like no. to... I've got nothing I can do to tinker. Really change that, so... Okay. I'm not calling her. <laughs> yeah. You're not going to tinker with Not my... the dog. <laughs> All right. Um, oh, well. Okay, so I've actually never read this before. Search your deck for any one card. Put that into your hand and shuffle your deck. Cool. So I'll do that first. So I'll edit this bit out. <laughs> so you don't have to read for every just card. Just time lapse. Speed it up real quick. <laughs> Right, I've got this card here. I'll put that there and then I'll shuffle. You'll find out soon enough what it is, audience. You don't have to know what it is. Not yet. <laughs> so that's interesting. I get to pick a card from my deck. That's yeah, like that's weird. A, the first time I've seen something like that. I gain two blood power. Um, and then I deal 10 damage. Now, can I use that blood power? All four of them? To heal equal to the amount of damage you successfully dealt this roll phase. Wouldn't you have had to have activated them before, though, like you did earlier? Well, but when can tokens be used? Aren't they, can't they be used any time? Yeah, they are instant, so I would assume you can use mm -hmm. them. Otherwise... All right, so uh, based off what it says here, and again, this is irrelevant to what I'm actually doing, but I guess speaks to what I'm doing. Um, what did it say? Uh, when I activate my ulti ultimate ability and get to search my deck, can I find a card that would add damage and then immediately play that card to increase the damage of the ultimate? And the answer is yes, because all damage is dealt simultaneously at the conclusion of a roll phase. Awesome. So because I'm using tokens and they're like an instant, I guess, yep. I can use them after my, my roll phase to increase, and because I gained them, and then I attack, I guess. Yeah, because it all happens instead. Yeah, so I'll do 10. On, it's only 10, so it's not yeah. like it's 15. So I'll do 10 damage to you. Ooh. And I gain 10, putting me on 30. Cool. And I use all four. That was the most natural ultimate. No. <laughs> and that is how you roll a natural ultimate. <laughs> no, I had to use so many cards. But again, like I had the CP to do that. Yeah, exactly. Mm. If you, and if you can do it, why not do it? That's the whole point. And then of. it's at the end of my turn, so I'll use main phase two, and I'll use two more CP to upgrade my card. Which immortal is the card Flash. I just, I yep. just uh, got more from my deck. It just gives me an extra dice. Not a bad one. Your All turn. Right. Upkeep. Tick. Take a damage. Yep. Income. And you also have to roll for Gain your blood. CP. No, you got rid of blood. I will play a good old us. Vegas baby. Classic card. Best card in the game. Gain a CP. Every CP helps, man. I certainly Every does. CP helps. All right. On to the rolly phase. Two, two, three, three, six. Hmm. Hmm. Eh, yeah, bugger it. re -roll a lot. You sure? Yep. He's Just going for it. Cause That's a little better. He loves those pendants. Yeah. Uh, where are we? Six, six. Five, one. Alrighty. ba -bow. One, two, five, six? Not quite straight. <laughs> you, you've got a Holy Blade level one. I do, I do. Um, you can't change any dice. I don't think I've got anything helpful there. No, no, I can't. Cool. So it's just a straight up five damage. Right, let's do four dice now that I've upgraded. All right, so I gain a blood power and that's it. And take, yeah, five damage. No, a blood Ooh. power. One blood power, not two. All right, so that puts me on to 24. I've taken the lead here towards the end. <clears throat> All right. Um, it's, again, because I have healing abilities, you don't. I feel like, and again, most people will disagree I've with got, this. I've got a heal there with Purify. Oh, okay. But it's only a small one. I feel like I've got a few little bleeds here and there. And again, I've got gained these tokens so easily mm. that I haven't had any problem healing. 
All right. My turn? Uh, turn, turn. Officially my turn. Three and draw. Okay. Um, I will use both this CP here that I just got, putting me down to one to upgrade my Glamour to Glamour 2. I feel like we don't upgrade mm. enough. But I never <laughs> get upgrades. I, I actually don't get them very often, yeah. which is why I picked them out. And I'll go for a <coughs> roll. Excuse me. Um, cool. Ooh, 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 ooh. There's two blood there. Blood is good. Blood good. Could always try for that last hand you need. Rend. Which is fairly easy. Yeah, I'll do that, actually. Thank you. Good strats. Good strats. No, well, we, we may be opponents and all that jazz, but you know. They were, that was okay. Yeah, yep. Yeah, all good. Or that. That's also an option. Mm, what you going to do? Yeah, I'm going to go for... Ooh. Tree four. Nothing handy to me. Nope, um, I don't think so. Three four. I do have a card that I can use. If you got it, use it. Alright. Uh, use my last CP for try try again. Euro chosen team at me. Reroll up to two dice. Two there that need rerolling. <laughs> I shouldn't have done this. No! <laughs> well, it's worth the shot. You never know. You might have gotten um, the sixes you need. I have nothing that I can do. Oh, no. Close. No cigar. No cigars? And I have zero CP. That's probably good. Smoking is bad for you. <laughs> exactly. Cancer and all that jazz. Yeah, says, says you. Yeah, it says the chronic smoker. <laughs> all right, that is my turn. Useless. I've cool. got no more cards left. No CP. All right, well, tick. Take damage. Takes me up to four CP. We'll draw a card. I got too selfish. I tried to get another ultimate. Didn't uh, need it. Didn't need it. Need it. It's got to be patient, Vic. Patient. Onto the Rolly McRoll face. Look at that. All sorts four, of things. Five, six. Four, five, six. Mm, mm, mm. And you're winging pretty hard too. Winging very hard. Oh, close to a straight, large straight, or a small straight. We're all. Oh no! Could this be what I need? Actually, that does let me get something off. That's all right. So you've got two fives, a four and a six. Four, five, five, six. Um, which, well, I actually only need those. Oh, yep. Yeah. Do I want to? Nah. Cool. All right. That's your, is that, that's your heal one, isn't it? Uh, purify. Choose a player. If that player is an opponent, deal five undefendable damage. Otherwise, that player heals four. So if I pick myself, I'll heal. Um, and you can also remove a status effect from that player. If you pick an opponent, it just deals five damage. Oh, you don't um, get to pick a status effect? No, it's okay. it's a, yeah, if player is an opponent, deal five damage. Okay. Otherwise, that player heals four. Additionally, you may remove a status what effect. What would you player. like to do? I'm going to go with the undefendable damage. I probably would have done that too. Yeah. Putting me on 18. Just try and cut you back down to size a little bit. One point difference. 18 to 17. Oh, this is probably one of the closest matches we've, yeah, we've, for sure. we've had, that's for, for sure. sure. Both an ultimate, exciting. All right. Uh, and it, turn. Yeah. I do. The, one of the things that is fun about this game is you get to go pretty quickly. You don't have to wait yeah. ages for your turn sometimes. All right. Um, cool. Go straight for a roll. Many hands make many hands. <laughs> um. That gives you your rend, doesn't it? Oh, no, close to your end, Not quite. What's he going to do? What's he going to do? Going to try for that ultimate again? <laughs> no, yeah, from here. I've only got one card left. Go on. Try for the ultimate. You know you want to. Well, that's the opposite of trying for the ultimate, man. <laughs> um, I'll do that. Uh, deal seven damage. 
Cool. But also, I'll, uh... Yeah, I'll just do that. I'll save my blood power. You'll save your blood power? Yeah. So it's just seven damage? Yeah. Do I have anything useful? All right, let's uh, roll a defensive D. Four. Uh, Actually, do I want to? I will play my zero CP better D. Chosen player may perform a re-roll of up to five dice during their defensive roll phase. But because you only get one. <laughs> I only got one dice. <laughs> but it still lets me re-roll it. Hey. No. Well, okay. Take two damage instead of me defending one. That's right, that's better. <laughs> yeah, that's actually so better. I do seven to that's you. That's right, takes me all the way down to ten. It's close. Sixteen mm. to ten. But you could do an ultimate here and take me I down. I could never know what'll happen. Take me down to three. Okay. That's my turn. Alright. Alright, we will do that. Uh, tick, take a damage. Ah. <laughs> One, two, spend two CP to take me from five back down to three and so upgrade my Holy Smite. He also has Blessing of Divinity, so if I get him to zero health, he goes back up to one. Um, <laughs> so i got to at least kill him twice. And Holy Smite 2 doesn't actually change much from the original. Uh, it's still all the same abilities it and everything. It one. does add a new ability there, though. Holy Command, Trip Swords. I had that with my Glamour, too. It also added... Uh, There's a lot of the split cards like that. The yeah. upgrades aren't so much upgrades as just giving you it's more cool, to do. It's cool, which is cool. Yeah, yeah it's absolutely. not a bad thing at all. Um, we should play like an OP game where we pull all the upgrade cards and play with fully upgraded guys from, from the, the get-go. Like that would be Power awesome. Battles mode. That is awesome idea, man. So we'll, we might have to lottery <laughs> that one and, and no, see how yeah. it goes. Yeah, that's great. Um, that's a great idea. All right, in the meantime... What's that do? You know what? No, I'll save it. I'll save it. Why? What are you, what are you thinking? I was thinking, thinking something, but then I decided not to. Well, okay then. Hmm. I generally find hmm. fives do not much. I use quite a lot of them though, so it's... I mean, you can heal <laughs> or do more undefendable damage to me or whatever. It's always kind of awkward. Um, yeah, let's do that. Tree four gives me... When you did this damage to me, I didn't do a defensive roll, did I? Three, four, four. No, you did not. Okay, you good. just took the damage. Mint. Like a good little boy. Good, like no mistakes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we've got a three, four, five there. Can Can we get what we want? Not really. Another four and a five. I don't think that actually does anything for me. Is that your last roll? That was my last roll too. So I have... Diddly Bupkis. You can't tip a dice? No, I've got no tips or anything. That is an unsuccessful offensive roll phase for me. That could be a loss of the game right there. That could like, hurt. Not now, but... No, that could hurt a lot, not being able to get anything done there. Devo. All right, uh... Is that it? Devastated, yeah, and that'll be turn. Right, I'll gain a CP and draw a card. Alright, cool. Um, I will use both my CP to upgrade another one to straight up to gouge three. Woo! So I get three of, on three of a kinds, gain blood power. power. That's not bad. Three of a kind's on the low end ain't too hard to do. Mm. All right. Three, four, five, six. You've got a small straight in there. I'll keep that. Should have not just not say anything next time. I probably would only, yeah. won't even notice. No, I'm kidding. That's not within the spirit of no, it. No, no, exactly. <laughs> the tabletop nights are legit. Oh, that's another six. And, and a three. three. So we do a small straight. So a small straight looks like your option. Would you like to tinker with that? Um, I got Jack. All right. I will also use this bleed token. Yeah, not worth it. It is yep. now gone. So I'm doing nine damage. Oh no. Plus, I will use blood boil. I oh, know. So I'll add another damage to that. Mm. Putting me on ten. Which makes it ten. Um. So. Again, the order of the card sometimes confuses me. So I add one. So my attack modifier adds one damage. Yep. So with my straight, I do a small straight, deal seven damage and roll one dice. If I inflict bleed, does this 
card go to that? Oh no, because I've already used it. You've already modified it. Yeah, yep. Yeah, right. Just modifying the base attack. I do. I gain mesmer mesmerize. You gain a mesmerize token. And deal eight damage. Yep. No. Defend you roll. Nine damage. Nine. Ten oh, damage. Sorry, ten damage. Ten yeah. damage. Ten damage. Uh, take two back. And I would go sploot. So he only has 10 damage. I do 10 damage, he goes to zero, but his blessing of divinity kicks in oh, and sets my health back to one. I live for now. For now. Mesmerized. That'll be turn. Yeah, that's my turn. Cool. Yeah. Uh, tick, take a damage. <laughs> well, that, if you do. An ultimate here. Yeah, if I could somehow pull an ult, I could swing it. Yeah. Oops. Draw a card. But if you get an ultimate, I can use this mesmerize token um, to force you to reroll one dice. Just that so you would know. be pretty lame. Just so you know, mister. Well, that's all right. I'll spend two CP to play what status effects? What? Remove all status effect tokens from a chosen player. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Screw you, Mesmerize. Mesmerize. But it's only on the five or a six as well, by the way. None of that. All right. On to the rolly phase. Has to do 12 damage. Literally the only way I think I could get to that would be highest power, Archangel's Will, or Split the Heavens. Anything else I don't think comes close enough. But then I could still do a defensive rolling and still help. Yeah, yeah, you could still. So if I if you do any damage, I can. Hmm. That was pretty crap. <laughs> Bugger it. Oh, that's that a was good better. Roll. That's a good roll. Six. Three threes. sixes. I only need one more for highest power. Oh, denied. <laughs> Leaves me doing nothing again. So he's got three, four, and three sixes. Mm -hmm. Really nothing. Nothing you don't, there. You've got, you've got, oh, you've only got, you've got two CP. You can't tinker with any dice? No. Nope. No cards. All right. I'll change them in my favor anyway. Is it my turn? Um, um, um. Unfortunately, yeah, it's your turn. All right, gain a CP. Excellent. Let's go for the kill. Three hands and a blood. Oops, sorry. I'm going to re-roll that one too because yeah, yeah. I didn't realise. That's fine. Because okay. of the glitch that it's the a white eye. Yeah. Hey! But also, on three of a kind, I gain a blood power. power. But, before... <laughs> I will spend one CP... And play Helping Hand. Select one of your opponent's dice and force them to re-roll it. Pick one because they're all ones. Ha! Do I, did I have a third roll still? Yeah, you did. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there you go. You did stop it. I'm I'll dealing, take it. <laughs> I'm dealing, I still have three of a kind, so I still gain a blood power, but I'm dealing six damage. Which, even if I do fully defend, it won't. What are, what take are your, two what damage back. What do your tokens do? Uh, player with this token may discard it at any time oh. to remove a single status effect from themselves. Fair enough. Should be pretty irrelevant to remove my own holy presence. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. So that'll be splat. Well, I can't believe I came back from a ultimate from beginning. an ultimate opener, which was not rigged in any way. That actually just came up natural. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So that was uh, Vampire Lord versus Seraph. I've TJ remains defeated streak. I'm, victorious. Wait, I'm no. the victor. Unvictorious. 
Well, your name is Victor, so it makes sense. Yes. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> I'm blessed. Um, so we're about to actually record another video as well. So make sure you stay tuned if you're into other board games as well. We're about to record Splendor with a third person. So we're going to do three-player Splendor. So we'll see if I win that Hopefully. one too. <laughs> if you don't see it pop up, you know it all went horribly wrong. Yes. And... <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah. Good. Yeah. Because sometimes we record a video and then it doesn't ever come out. So. Some of us are talking too quiet or sometimes we just make too many mistakes. Yeah. It's like, no, we yeah. better not put that yeah. up. All right. Thank you very much for watching. Watching, um, I think this will be the first video of 2019. So if, if we don't get it up in this last week, in the last few days before yeah, thing, it'll be yeah. our first New Year's video. So happy New Year to you if it is your New Year, depending on what calendar you follow, depending on where you are in the world. Thanks for watching anyway. I've been TJ. That's been Vic. Weather Tabletop Thank you Nights. so much. See, See you later. later.